<laughs> I have no idea what today's episode has to do with a beach. How we go from a beach to what's next, I have no idea. But I guess I'll figure it out. Do you ever feel like you're being watched? We're here. Jeez, relax. Almost got rocket soda in the back of the head. That's gotta be a flying liability. No wonder we're not allowed to fly as humans. <laughs> Somebody have their leftover KFC just come up and hit them straight in the head, knock them unconscious. Then autopilot takes over and who knows where Elon Musk is gonna take you. You'll wind up at Epstein Island for all we know. I have no idea why I came here. Just needed to see you. I miss you. Damn. That guy be bouncing. That's like the plane from that movie where Snoop Dogg's a pilot. <laughs> Wait. The five hillmen and their friend. Has the book changed? Have I rewritten the past? Am I the friend? I'm in a book. $25 for a book. That means I lost like $100 in books. I'll never forget. The arcade's in here. It's not an urban legend. It, it's right over here. Was I standing in the middle of the road reading? <laughs> this isn't the right book. All right. Well, it's okay. We need it for the collection. So there, there it is. Oh, Granny's getting old. Can't remember what book to get. Your books are kind of expensive considering they're like a three minute read. If you are learning how to read. <laughs> You see, what I'm trying to do is actually rebuy all of the books. It's kind of like a, a magic trick where, you know, where he says, is this your card? And it's not your card, but like he knows it's not your card and he's about to pull. That's what I'm doing. This is definitely all part of the plan. All right, I'll try this book. And, and if not, I'm going to the library because I don't know what the heck I'm looking for anymore. What the heck, dude? You're turning into my lane of traffic. People that drive around here. Absolute psychos. This guy ate half a donut of the garbage can. How do I have this already? What did I read? And why am I 5% happy after eating garbage? Because my true form is a raccoon. This is what I'm looking for. Must have read it by accident one day. What weird gas stations they have in the future. Just on the sidewalk nowhere to park your car who's the mayor around here i would like to run i'd clean this place up welcome to the wild west heard some of you out there are cowboy or cowgirl or cow other not utter other other fans of the wild west that's what we'll call you i thought we'd take ourselves a little tour isn't VR great? We can just, like, we almost traveled back in time to Pine Lake. Everyone gather around in front. Come on, get your picture. This place is a bit of a ghost town. What's going on? Is everything okay? I hid my car all the way over there, so there shouldn't be any issues. Are these people riding donkeys? What the heck are those? Are you just like a regular? Oh, I thought you were like a sheriff. <laughs> I like your donkey, dude. Hey, your donkey don't like me? What the hell is this? <laughs> your donkey look a little dopey. I don't know what's wrong with him. What a time to be alive. <laughs> is everyone here have one? I need one. Oh, this guy's got a horse. Is that how you show your like prestige back in this day? It's not about your shoes or your belt. It's about if you can afford a horse or a donkey. Wait, come back. I want to talk to you. Find a job. No, I don't want a job. Definitely not here to work. I'm a tourist. I'm here to visit. Do you go to Hawaii and work? Or do you go to Hawaii to go to the beach? Like, let's be real. I've never been to Hawaii, so I would, I'm, I'm, I'm genuinely asking. This place is just like a time capsule. This place never changes. And neither do you. Your knees must be so sore. I really hope you at least have, you know, like the things that like carpenters use the little knee pads not the ones that rollerbladers use like the, the nice soft spongy ones maybe a pillow <laughs> is this the equivalency of a biker gang 
What do you guys call yourselves? The assassins? <laughs> that was the best I could come up with. I sat there for a good solid minute trying to think of something. How's it going, Clint? Everything safe, pal? Okay, well, I came to offer you my assistance, but it's all right. Clint's not worried about it yet. I'm, I'm a little bit early. Thought me and Clint might catch up a little bit first. I wasn't... My timelines are all off. I can't remember when I last spoke to Clint. I don't know what Clint knows me and what Clint doesn't know me. Do any of them? Did he get his mind wiped like men in black? Did a disproportionate alien that looks like it lives off of a diet of Cheetos and Mountain Dew zap his eyeballs? Hello, sir. What, uh, what you got going on? What you got going on back here? Maybe I could just rub this joint before they do. Okay, no, no, no. I don't want to be... And then this guy's going to say, I scouted the place out. Does anyone sell anything around here? What do you even want a job for if there's nothing to buy? Half of these buildings aren't even finished. They're just framing. And a bunch of lazy... I can't I can't say it too many times. We're going to get the hammer. Where do we buy a donkey? Or a horse? I'll buy a horse, of course. Got a barn over here. Nothing in it. What kind of a waste is this? I'm here to buy a horse, damn it. Why are there so many buildings? I guess all those donkey guys probably live around here. Could someone point me in the direction of the horses? You. Hey, I'm talking to you. Any nice places? The church is nice. Okay, yes, I've been there. Anything else? Do you know where to get a horse? Okay, well, that's just awkward now. Just trying to make light talk. Instead of just diving right into it and asking you where I could get a horse. Oh, someone stole the telescope. I wanted to stare at the sun and go blind. Oh, it was just a little fall. Come on. Where's the cyberpunk steel leg modification? In the year of 2077, you can get cyber legs that reduce, that allow you to fall from higher heights without taking fall damage. Thoughts? Maybe I'm the only one that constantly takes damage to falling? Hey, what are you guys gathered around here for? Okay, we got a couple sheriffs. Or are they sheriffs in disguise? Uh-oh. 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 Are they coming for me? Or are they coming for the bank? Oh, I can stop this. Where is it? I haven't used this in a while. Yeah. <laughs> How do you like that? I don't know how to reload. There we go. And where I helped, I used my bare hands as well. As, as tough manly men in the Wild West would do. Giving them a couple extra slap arounds, you know, like a spanking. Didn't your mother ever teach you any manners? They stole my horse. Do you know where I could get my horse back? He knows I didn't have a horse. I could tell I've never ridden a horse a day in my life. Oh, I found another one. We're gonna sneak up on him. Okay, he's looking at me. I, I was confused. Come on. Oh my gosh, you hurt. Ugh. Oh, why am I doing this? Is that's it? The flash. Oh no, wait. This isn't the one that has the sword attachment. Yeah, you want some? Come get some. Again, I use my fist. You saw it. Give me a nice steak. I've earned it. You can keep that little piece as your tip. And dang, I can't even get a donkey. What does that make me? Wait. Wait. I have found it. Everyone, hold on. I am about to be rolling in style. Wait, how do we take this with us, though? <laughs> do we just leave it here? I want to buy a horse eye. If you know which one, bring it here. Oh, donkey for 120, horse for 550. Man, donkey is quite a discount, but I don't think I could be caught seeing riding on a donkey. So I think we go with the brown horse. So I've already seen someone on the black horse. It's not as cool if you don't have like a one of one, you know, and this one kind of looks like a big donkey. So I'm going to go with this one. 
Come on, horsey. Oh, that is so cool. He follows me. He likes me already. Now what happens if I switch items? <laughs> All right, Steve, I've picked out my horse. Yeah. Oh, that was a lot of money, horse. You better, you better be a good time. Have a good one, Steve. I'll always remember you. As I'm horse drifting. Oh, yes. This is our time, horsey. Yeah, what, what now? Oh, horse, come back. Oh, no, horse, run. Right off into the sunset. I'm new to the whole horse thing. I am protecting this bank. Don't you ever come back. I'm being paid to protect it, but feels like the right thing to do. This thing's pretty fast. I got the fastest horse in town. Anyone want to challenge that? Oh, look at you. Hey, I couldn't get a white horse. What the heck is this? How'd you get that? Any moment now. There's going to be a robbery. <laughs> Unless those two guys were the robbers. Oh! <laughs> oh! They're going in the back. Where are they? Where is he? Where's the thief? Is this him? Hey, get over here. Oh, gosh, he hurts. I got this and this. I'm here to save the bank. Oh, there we go. You're welcome. Hey, Westwood. <laughs> here goes. I uh, kind of, you know. Flex my muscles a little bit. He's no big deal. Time agent. What the? What is on his back? Oh yeah, that's the time travel thing. Are you punching me? Hey, hey, relax. Good to see you, kid. How's the time travel business going? I guess the agent is taken care of. Oh, he does know me. What the hell? You were treating me like I was a nobody earlier. All of a sudden, I'm the hero of the town. And I get special treatment. It's good to see you though, buddy. I know I went on that whole rant and stuff, but I guess your adventures have ended well. Well, I wouldn't say that. Well, let's take this bandit to my office so we can interrogate that guy. Hey, my gold. I guess I'll have to open up the reserves in the bunker. Um... Guys, were you supposed to take me with you? I don't I don't think you were supposed to leave me in the vault. Guys. Lonely. What the Hey! Hey! Are they beating my horse? Don't let them do that. Come, come on, guys. I got this. We're gonna get out of here. Hi ho Silva! Away! All right, there's no flying out of here. This is dangerous now. Get off, get off, get off. I'll send an SOS to the world. I'll send an SOS to the world. <laughs> Day 13. I've run out of food. Money doesn't buy much in a cell. I can feel my inner thoughts creeping into reality. I no longer can tell the difference between an impulse and a bad idea. Monologues off the top of your head are not the easiest, especially as insanity seeps in. There's one thing I want written on my inevitable tombstone. I would like it to say, here lies the man who breaks the game.